so what I would say is get your army of people to help you. Yeah. Um, and remember, it takes a village to raise the kids. Yeah. So it's don't be ashamed to ask for help when you need it. So if you have a sister, a brother, a, f a good friend, and you need a break, then get somebody to help you and don't be afraid to ask. Yeah. Welcome to Twin Talks. I'm Nadia. And I'm Nikki. And today's episode is about what I what we wish we had known before becoming a parent. Yeah. What did you wish you had known? What were some of the challenges that you've seen other people have? Well, I think with um, with everyone, you know. Yes. The thing is when you have these little people come in, it's another it's another entity, yeah. right? And it does change the dynamic of the home for a little bit, right? There's always a little bit of growing pains. I guess for people to just be patient and understand that eventually they'll fit into the framework of the family. Sometimes it's a little hard though when you're going through it. So do you think, Nikki, that sometimes when you're a younger parent it could be a lot easier than it being an older parent? I think with younger parents, they are spry and they have the energy and a lot of the times they have the patience. Sometimes it's, a little, sometimes it's a little harder when you're older, but it doesn't mean that older people can't do it because they're wise too and they are grateful and usually they're happy to take it on. But I would say for older parents, um, that's a hang in there thing because sometimes you have them later you don't know what you don't know and you get set in your ways and it becomes really hard because now you don't have the time that you once had. And let's be clear, some people who've always wanted to be parents are parents and they may not like being a parent, but there's no real conversation about not liking it, right? Yeah. I'm sure there's not a lot of people out there that don't enjoy parenting but are too afraid to admit they don't enjoy everything about it. Well, what do you have to say to that? A lot of people don't enjoy everything about it. Yeah. And you know, I was talking to people and uh, a lot of them said they felt ashamed Why? saying it. That Why? They, they didn't enjoy it because they thought it'd be one thing and didn't really understand the magnitude of what people were saying and they happened to be older parents. Yeah. So they felt a little ashamed coming out after waiting all this time and realizing, oh, I, I don't know if I like it right now. It's killing me. Like, they're really tired. So the people who you're talking to, them, they have younger kids or newborns they or teenagers? They have young kids now, under school age, and they're a little bit older. And um, so what I would say is get your army of people to help you. Yeah. Um, and remember, it takes a village to raise the kids. Yeah. So it's don't be ashamed to ask for help when you need it. So if you have a sister, a brother, a good friend, and you need a break, then get somebody to help you and don't be afraid to ask. Yeah. Also, talk to your spouse more. And if you need that time to say, you know what? I need an hour or two just to take a walk or whatever. You guys have to work together and communicate to make things happen, right? And especially if you are a single parent, then you gotta commandeer your people. Yeah. Because it's just so hard. It's just so. Those are some of the difficulties, and don't be ashamed to admit it. You've always got someone that can help you, whether you're um, a single parent or whether you have a, a spouse. And you know what? If you like us, you like us on Facebook, YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram. And click below for the full episode. Until next time, see you next time on Twin Talks.